Hey, this is Kevin Tanner coming to you with a review. Today we're taking a look at the Micro Galaxy Squadron Scout Class Series 3. We're going to look at Count Dooku on his speeder. So we're going to go ahead and take a look at the figure, at the vehicle, we'll look at the stand, we'll do some measurements, and then we'll do a comparison. Let's go ahead and dive into the review. So we're going to go ahead and start out looking at the box here. Um, so I don't actually have the PDQ that has all of the um, blind boxes in it. Um, but it does have the same type of artwork that would be on there. So we got uh, your Jedi Interceptors here on the front, as well as you get this little picture here that this is a mystery box, and that is one of the figures and vehicles you can get inside. When you look at the side of this, it also has some more artwork here on the side. You get Grievous's ship, another Jedi Interceptor, another battle scene going on. And then over here on this side, we get all of the different uh, vehicles and figures that are going to come in this line, or sorry, in this series. And so we're going to be taking a look at one of the chases here, which is uh, Count Dooku on his speeder. So um, let's go ahead and take a look at the figure first. So uh, they did a really, really nice job with this um, Count Dooku. Um, the uh, cape is removable. You can see that there's actually a different color on either side of the cape, which is really nice. Um, they got a beard on him. They've got, uh, you know, like this really glossy material on his, um, his coat or his shirt, whatever you want to call it there. Belt is painted. He's got a saber there on it, on his side. Uh, black boots. Um, I mean, I think they just did such a great job here with Series 3 with all of these figures. Um, you can see that the feet are just a little bit wider, which is nice. It makes it easier to display in standing. And so... Um, as you could see, uh, well, actually, really quick, we'll just do a quick measurement here. He is one inch tall. And so then again, if we take a look at the speeder here, um, we can see the speeder here is about one and seven eighths inches. And uh, there's no real speeder that we can compare it to. Um, really quick, just flip this over on the side here so you can see how that stand functions. Um, we don't have any other speeder to compare it to because this is really just a standalone, which is nice. Uh, it's great to be able to have some of these where we don't actually have something to compare it to. And so um, this is a fantastic one. Super excited to have this in the collection. Um, and that is that on the review. So um, just really quick, as you can see how I had him positioned on the bike initially, when you put him on here, um, the cape doesn't really fit super well on him. Um, to be able to display in like a flying position, you can kind of rest it on there and it will look okay for display. So if you like the review, please go ahead and hit like and subscribe. Also go ahead and check out the description. I've got a link in there to a Facebook page of Romans and friends from all over the world with a bunch of other collectors of these micro collection or micro galaxy squadron vehicles. Thanks and see you again on the next review.